comfortable frame of mind at the moment. We've got those rather blustery and fresh west winds, but next week well, the winds will start to ease off. We'll start to see pressure rising across the British Isles, and then we'll start to pull in much warmer east or southeasterly winds. So temperatures will be on the rise. We'll lose the greens and the yellows and start to see much warmer oranges taking over, particularly during the second half of the week. And in fact, particularly across England and Wales, we could start to see temperatures up to around 22 or 23 degrees. So as I said, changes underway. At the moment, though, it is rather windy. We've got a real run of westerly winds coming in from the Atlantic, bringing a lot of cloud. This little system actually bringing rather more general rain now into western parts of Scotland. And really, I think through this evening and tonight, it is going to be a rather cloudy picture. And there'll be increasing amounts of rain and drizzle around these western fringes. More general wet weather still feeding into the northwest. And still a blustery night as well. So with all the cloud and the wind, it will be a mild night. Now tomorrow morning then rather cloudy as well, still some rain about, but I think as that main front pushes its way southeastwards, the rain will tend to ease off and the cloud will break up a little bit as well. So say to the east of the Pennines, parts of the East Midlands, down into uh, the southeast, there'll be little bits of bright or sunny weather, these western fringes staying rather grey and gloomy, and the northwest seeing a fair amount of showers packing in on that blustery wind. Temperature wise though, well pretty good in the southeast, it has to be said, at around 18 degrees, but a fresh old day again in the northwest. Temperatures between about 12 and 14. That's it for now.